Hi, this is Dr. Gary, and welcome to our final tune-up of 2011. I'm not going to be here for the next four days, and again, I'm wishing all of you a very, very happy new year. For our final tune-up today, what I want to do is for us to all reflect on where we were one year ago today, when it was the end of 2010 and we're just moving into 2011. Did this year turn out like you thought it would? Did you accomplish the things you wanted to accomplish, or did you procrastinate again? As we start a new year, there's always those new things we want to accomplish. Many people want to lose weight, start exercising, do something that they've been procrastinating or putting off for a long time, and we have the best intentions to do it, and then a couple of weeks later it kind of falls off and we're back to our old patterns again. If you look back at last year and some of the things you wanted to accomplish, did they get done? And if they didn't get done, really ask yourself, what was keeping me from doing them? What was in my way? Always ask yourself, did I have the actual resources available to me to do those things? And if you find yourself you really didn't have those resources, the first thing to do is recognize that and then gain those resources, which could be capabilities, it could be funding, it could be anything, because we have to have a well-formed outcome which means we can actually do it and accomplish it before we really start on it. Most people start with New Year's resolutions without forming the outcome, looking at the resources they have, looking at the time they have available to do it, and also the desire. Is it doable by just them? Or do they expect a friend to help coach them along with it? So today, as we move into a brand new year, 2012, 2012, I want us to really, really take a look at what do we want to accomplish next year and what can we do today to start building up the resources, the arsenal of skills in order to get that done, and then what would be the first logical step in doing it. And then the next step after that, the next step after that, and sometimes it's helpful to even think about having it all done and engineer it backwards. What would be the the last thing you did before you completed it and then move backwards from there. Sometimes that even works better. Today I want to wish all of you a happy new year. I appreciate you spreading these tune-ups worldwide over the last year. This list has really grown and I appreciate it. And if you're receiving these tune-ups, understand part of the magic of this is not my pretty face on here. It's the message behind it that I feel is divinely led in some way through me. Pass this on to someone you think it can help today. Maybe this could be the best thing you do for someone each day. And as we grow this list over the next year, I look forward to you being with me and joining me in these tune-ups each day. And if you have any ideas that you want to share with me or even ideas you would like me to talk about, please email me. So until next year, this is Dr. Gary wishing you an extraordinarily safe and enjoyable holiday weekend. And I will see you next Tuesday in the first tune-up of 2012. Bye-bye.